What is going on YouTube? This your boy Clutch and I'm coming to you with another live commentary. Uh, trying to get everything set up guys. I apologize. Uh, what we're going to do is get into some gameplay uh, today. We're going to be playing some uh, Order of 1886. Um, if you watched my first episode, um, you noticed that we have uncovered the truth about the vampires and um, and the half breeds and things like that. So let's jump into the video. It's been a while since um, since I've played this, so just bear with me, guys, so I can get the controls down. Um, what we're trying to do here, so so you'll kind of get the gist of it, is uh, no, get down. Okay. Uh, what we're trying to do is get um, uh, get the um. Uh, is we're burning. A bunch of uh, wow they are really throwing grenades headshot man there are people everywhere Hmm. Why is there? I'm just going to start doming these guys. Till I get some health, man. Yeah, she really wants me to go down. What we're trying to do is we're trying to burn the, um, uh, we're trying to burn the, um, we're trying to burn the vampire crates. Um, and this is, this part is ridiculously hard. Come on. Yeah, I'm about to die. Yeah, get down, get down. Show your head, peep up. He's definitely not going to peep up, so I don't know what he's going to do. Man. There are people coming from everywhere. About time she's helping me. I mean, I know lighting crates is all hard and stuff. Oh, now they're going to come start coming downstairs. What the heck? This guy is really throwing grenades at me right now. It's like every headshot. There we go. Where's that other guy at? Hello. Goodbye. No, you're not. He's down. Nice, nice, nice. Light them up. They're vampires in those cases. So just so you know, if you haven't played the Order of 1886, man, great game. You need to go check it out. Oh, wow. This isn't good. 
Yeah, shut the door, shut the door, shut the door. Oh, wow. Boom. Wow, she lit his ass up. Nice. Nice, nice. Oh, this is not good. No, get off me, man. Get on the ground. Yes, sir. One down. Let's go. Hurry up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Where's the other one? Let's see ya. Push it through his heart. That a boy. Nice. Two down. Any more? Any more? Let's go ahead and get this rifle back. No, we're not hurt. No. Not yet, but hurry, break down the door. Everyone's running. Man, she she really set this place on fire and it's it's not really There's vampires in the cases. She set them on fire and now I'm killing freaking half breeds. This is crazy. Now I'm just going to manhandle this dude and I got him in the headlock. Let's go. Ooh. I hit the wrong button. Wow. I was hitting our freaking one. Shake my head. Wow. 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 All right, we're going to get him right here. We got the headlock on him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Boom. Stab him in the neck. Let me move my boom arm away, guys, just a tad bit. Yeah, we must flee. So we, we've done found out that the knights are involved in some kind of shipping trade for vampires. They're in the cases. We burned them. We got proof, and now we're going to help them. I mean, I'm a badass um, whenever it comes to this as the knight, but the government is really it's kind of like our government now they're always trying to fuck us in the long run and that's what they're doing in this game it's 2015 and this is the year 1886 and we're still getting fucked i mean really yeah you must help us we are going to be helping you come on man you got the lamb chops Whisper my name in Whitechapel and I will be there. Sounds pretty legit. I think this is, yeah, that was the end of chapter nine, guys. Right. What in the world is going on? Not now, sir. Don't walk away from me. I saw you at Whitechapel. Ooh. I followed you. I, I bet you were. Guys, what I'll do is after the end of this this interlog, I'll do a short video on this Let's Play, and then I'll do another video at the start of Chapter 10. What do you see? I don't know. A stranger. 
Well, he doesn't know who he can trust either. That's crazy. Izzy's just going to have to understand that this man's got on, he's on a mission right now. And he's trying to find out the truth. And the truth is, is that everybody's trying to screw that whole organization. And it's coming inside the freaking nights. Oh, yes, it does. Yeah. But they're the truth. Y'all got to... They're the truth, though. Come on. Yeah, and I had something to do with it. Apparently, a small group of rebels were seen on the docks. Or rather, they were introduced to the convoy. Yes, <laughs> Yeah, because you're probably in on it too. Did you wish I can attempt to persuade the Lord Chancellor to put the matter before the council if it is true that we have a traitor in our midst? Not to doubt the fact of his complicity. Stealth mission. Love it. Well, Mallory had our back. Nobody else does. They were probably in on him dying. Oh, there's a big conspiracy. We know that. Oh, it's going to get hairy. It's going to get really hairy. I mean, just the details in this game, guys, from, from the rain to the streets to the cars, it's actually phenomenal. I'm trying to record in full 1080p, but I'm having difficulty doing it properly. So, guys, I know that the video is only in 720, but, you know, bear with us. And, uh, oh, wow, Chapter 10 was just a prologue, so now we're in 11. So, before we start this, guys, 18th day of October, 1886, Duke Street, Mayfair. Um, guys, before we start, uh, this next mission, we're running a little short on time. So I appreciate you stopping by my channel. I appreciate you stopping by my channel. Please like, please subscribe. And I'll see you on the next let's play for the order of 1886. Economics. I know how to work, bitch.